A trip to the movie theater over the weekend with a vape pen turned into a medical emergency for three Baymanette teenagers. As WKRG News 5's Debbie Williams reports, their close call should serve as a warning to parents. Movie night at the theater in the Eastern Shore Center turned out to be anything but entertaining. We have, we're juveniles, 13 and 14 years of age on a Saturday night come across a vape, they think they're going to have fun and sit there and smoke a vape while they're watching a movie. All of them have a physical reaction. All three given medical attention at a local urgent care, treated and released the vape called Cake, now evidence at the Spanish Fort Police Department, gotten for just under $25 online. And in that liquid, THC. Delta 8 THC. To be legal in the state of Alabama, you have to be less than 0.3% THC by, by volume. Uh, that's what's being at least marketed for this thing. And that's the disturbing part for Chief John Barber. What is really in that liquid? It is unknown exactly what you're getting in that liquid, what exactly the percentage of THC might be, uh, because we're finding that these vapes are marketed all throughout the country. Uh, they're not well regulated, and that's what we're seeing where they're mixed in with fentanyl or some other known unknown derivative. Barbara applauds the actions of the parents that were with those three teenagers that night, their call for help, and the disciplinary action they've taken. He says there will be no criminal charges filed. As for the vape, Barbara says it will be tested to find out exactly what the ingredients are in this cake. On the Baldwin County Beat, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.